this amount of money. What's that? The quarter seems to be the biggest amount of money, so yep. I'm gonna put the biggest coin there. Okay. Remember when I was in the in that home when I was still doing the Hold on a second. Is this are these quarters? Or are these look at the picture. Not the picture on here, but like match the size of the coin to what I have here. Oh see. I see. I'm sorry, I interrupted you. What were you saying? Remember when I was like back in like like when I was still in first grade homeschool and Nope, that's not it. When I was still in um, first grade um, homeschool uh -huh. and I was doing, um, and I was doing, uh, and I was doing um, like the, uh, this like game where you have a square, you have a spoon and you don't want to drop what's in the spoon. Yep. That would be fun to do after we're doing this. Okay. Like multiple games in a day. Yeah, we got multiple games. Penny. I think I am these things. Cause last time you showed me all of these were gold. All the pennies were gold. So I'm gonna use all the gold ones. Also these are really small. Okay. These are pennies. Uh-huh. And what's that last one? Nickel. Right. Okay. So now, count your pennies. Okay. So, two twenty-five dollars equals twenty-five cents. Twenty. Why don't you start from the lowest value and then work your way up? Okay. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So write down nine cents. Nine cents. Okay. Is this erasable? Here, you can use the knife. No, use the pencil. So, nine cents. Mm -hmm. So, we're going to write down total. No, it's not the total. This is, these are subtotals. Yeah, but, like, we're going to Okay, write... total penny. We're going to, like, no, like, t like, we're going to total so far. Okay. But the reason I said total is because eventually it's going to be the total. Yep, it's true. That's why. Yep. So how many pennies did you have? So we're going to write the total here. And we're going to write nine. Total counted. That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> okay. Why are you laughing? No, oh, it's you being exact with your terms. It's good. Okay. Counted. Did you remember how many cents you have in pennies? Nine. Nine. Cents. And, and since each penny is a single cent, Nine pennies makes nine cents. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we'll work on that. Uh, ah. So now how much, how many nickels do we have? Um, why are you recording this on YouTube? I mean, I'm just recording it. We could post it if you want to. Yeah. So guys, welcome back. <laughs> I mean, you're a little late. I know, I know, but... This, um, the total counted here is nine cents so far because we counted all these penny, pennies and so far this is nine cents. Now we're gonna go on to the nickels, which every nickel is five cents. So one, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five. What's five and five? Um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we're gonna go ten. Ten, and then another five. Yeah, and then another five. So ten. Eleven, twelve. 
13, 13, 15. Yep. So you got 15. So we're going to... So you got nine in pennies and... Erase the nine. But Okay, but... So you have nine. No, don't erase that yet. Keep keep the nine there for a second. Okay. So that was nine pe nine cents in pennies. And then we had 15 cents in nickels, right? So put 15 cents, right? Mm -hmm. Because eventually we're going to have to add 15 to that nine, right? Because that's we'd add the pennies to the nickels. So you have 15 here and nine here. So... What is 15 plus 9? Do you want to just write it over here? Like put 9 here and then 15 here? Yeah, 9. Right, 9 here. 15 cents in 15, nickels. 15, 1, Okay, five. and then we'll add all that stuff up later. But Yeah, this is the total, and we're not we're going to erase count it now because we're not. <laughs> What's going on with the OGs what, here? What's going on? Ah! It's not the time to be silly here. We're oh, counting money. You're right. It's not, it's not time to be silly when you're counting money. Yeah. Time enough for counting when the dealing's done. Okay, cool. so let's move on to our, uh, oh, we're still parsing our terms? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. We're going to write. About... Right. There we go. Okay. So we're not done yet. So let's move on to diamonds. How many diamonds do we have? Oh my gosh, I thought you were saying diamonds for at first. How many diamonds do we have here? How many, <laughs> how many dimes do we have? Dime? Okay, let me sort these. I think we have the most pennies out of everything. I know, but how many dimes do we have? How many dimes? We have three dimes. And how much are each dime worth? Each dime are worth five cents. Are they? Yes. Is that what it says? Yes. Is that a dime? Oh, uh, ten. Ten cents. So how many mm -hmm. how many dimes do we have? We have three dimes. So how much is that in cents? How much is that in cents? If each ten. one is ten cents, yeah. and we have three of them. Okay, that's going to be a lot. Think about it. Mm. So... 10, and then another 10 is... Okay. 10 plus 10 is... 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20. Okay, so then you add 10 more to 20. Okay. Is how much? If, if 10 plus 10 is 20, 20 then 20 uh, plus 10 21, is... 21, 22, 23, 24, okay. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 30. So that's how many cents you have in dimes. So put that next to the dime. Mm-hmm. And then oh, your three is backwards, kiddo. No cares. No, but we just want to practice the right orientation. Okay, 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 it's, fine. It's not, it's not a big deal, but, mm -hmm. you know. I always get so mad when I do that. I know, but you don't have to. I used to do that all the time, too. Okay. Um, and then what's our last one? Uh, so, quarter is 25 cents. Wow! You know what's a cool thing about quarters? Could you see, did you see this key up here? Mm-hmm. What does it say? It says 100 cents equals one job. Right, so if each quarter is worth 25 cents then if you if you have four of them you'll have a dollar and so right the name of the coin actually represents what percentage of a dollar it is so this is a quarter of a dollar right so if you have four of them you have a dollar but if this is 25 i'm going to help you with this one because it's a little tricky okay 25 plus 25 Okay, so if four of them make a dollar, and a dollar is a hundred cents, then two of them would be half of a dollar. So half of a hundred is what? Do you know? Half of a ninety-nine? No, it's fifty. Fifty? What the heck? That so, doesn't make sense. No, see, twenty-five plus twenty-five equals fifty. So why don't you put fifty over here? You're 
I don't, I don't mean to, to bother you. I know what you're going to say. Yeah. Okay, now here's the big part. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. No, you got it. Uh. Come on. You can make it a little S-like. Now it's a free. That's not a, that's not, it's, first of all, that's a backwards string and it's not a number. Five, right, please. Okay. There you go. Okay, now, do you feel like you can add all of that up? Or do you need help? Uh, wait, is this supposed to be on Okay. Do you need help with this? Yes, it's a like hundred. Uh, I don't is think it's a hundred. It's it's is it one dollar? Uh, well, let's let's add them up and find out. Okay. Um, so let's let's break it up this way. So let's start with this. We'll we'll do two different ones. We have fifty. Plus 30. We're right. also supposed to be talking to the viewers. <laughs> yes, viewers. We're doing do 15 plus 30. Uh, 50 plus 30. And 15 plus 9. And by the way, you better be taking some notes for me. Because that's a whole thing. Help me out with this, Bob. Okay. So what is 0 plus 0? Uh, 0. 0. That's obviously What zero. is 5 plus 3? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right, eight. so you put the eight down here, right? So now we have 80, right? I have a question. Yeah, Is it unsafe for strangers to know how much money you have? Um, it's, it's just considered polite to keep that kind of stuff to yourself. Um, okay, so 15 plus nine. So let's do the ones first and then we'll move over to the tens, right? That's how you do it from the lower value to the higher value, right? Yeah, well, so, we're kind of telling them how much money we have right now. Well, this they might be surprised to find out that this isn't all the money that we have in the world. So this is fine if they know this number. What is 5 plus 9? You can count up from 9. Okay, from 9... Nine, ten, eleven. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, fourteen. No. Fourteen. Okay. Fourteen. Okay. So we put the four down, right? And then the and, and then, then the one. the one goes over to the tens, right? So one plus one is what? Two. Two. Okay. So now you have eighty and twenty-four. So if we have eighty 